Well, hello guys, Leo Show TV here, back again for another video. Today we are doing my second to last Lego Ninjago core set. This is set 71764 Ninja Training Center. 524 pieces, ages 7 plus, comes with Jay, Zane, and a Boa Destructor. Here's a good look at the front of your box. Here's a good look at the back of the box with the features of the set. Now let's open it up, build it, and take a look. All right, so here's everything we get in the Ninja Training Center. We're gonna start off with taking a look at the set itself. Here's what the training area looks like from the front. Here's what it looks like from the back. I don't know how well this is gonna work, so bear with me. You're supposed to knock this down. You're supposed to run into this with the spinner, and you're supposed to knock this one down. So just bear with me here. I'll give you the best take that I can. Well, you got to see a little bit of it. You guys have no idea how many takes I've tried to get this right. One last time, no matter what. This is the exact same structure and how it's built, except one of them has a printed piece and is separate, and one of them has a sticker and is attached and built into the Ninja Dojo Temple. Here is what the structure looks like from the front. Here's what the structure looks like from the back. Here's a pit of snakes. Here's a training dummy that's made out of wood. Let's see if we can get Zane over the snake pit. Well, he landed in the snake pit, not outside of it. Here we have the final structure. You can see what it looks like from the front. You can see some tree details as well. You got space for some mini figures here. You can see two printed pieces as well. Here's what the structure looks like from the back. All right, let's try this one final feature here. This may or may not work, so once again, bear with me. Okay, that did not work. Let's try this one more time, shall we? Bear with me. Okay, moving on to minifigures, we have Jay, Zane, and a Boa Destructor. You can see what they look like with their weapons and masks on. Of course, Zane doesn't have a shoulder pad and he doesn't have a weapon, but you can see all their torso detailings and leg detailings. Here's a good look at their back torso detailings. On to the ratings for the set. Now my problem with this set has nothing to do with the minifigures or the spinner for Zane. It has to do with the functions and how they are executed. I think that the box hypes up the features way too much. You guys saw how I failed at trying to do the features. They didn't work too well. So, yeah, that's my problem with this set. So, my rating is going to be a 7 out of 10. So, if you have enjoyed this video and you would like to see more from me, something you should know is my last LEGO Ninjago core set review for the entire wave will be Lloyd's Legendary Dragon. So if you want to see that review when it comes out, then please comment, like, and subscribe, and turn on notifications, and I will see you next time. Goodbye!